So this comes from the business by design course that we're doing where we're using a, we're doing a business macabre where we're using uh, a lot of different things from astrology, from jinkies and from human design. And we are creating like this kind of blueprint or map for how to, how to build your business, how to uh, do your soul business in the world. So this is part of that, but we, that's just where it comes from. So aura, aura is the way that we connect, uh, that we connect and our experience by others. That's what Ra said. That's why he said it's so important. Your aura type is the most, almost the most important things to know from the beginning. And then we have, you know, it is, it is about, it is about living our design. And when we know our aura, and here we, make it smaller. And here Ashley has done those uh, beautiful ways of seeing the aura. So this would be a generator. No, this would be a manifester. I don't know where she started. Is this the manifester? This is the generator. This is the projector and this is the reflector, I believe. <laughs> yes, that's correct. That's correct. And then here is where you find it in your in your chart type. So pure, this is me, I think, pure generator. And then strategy to respond, themes, satisfaction, or frustration. So if I live true to my design and I respond to life, I'm going to feel satisfaction. If I don't do that, it's frustration. So that's just to show you. And here is this yeah here we have all the auras again i think we have the words that are coming with it Oops. yeah and here like we were saying so if you are a manifester and you live your design you you inform you're going to have peace if you're a generator and you respond you're going to have satisfaction if you are um a projector and you you make sure that you're recognized you're going to have success and if you're a reflector uh then you are here to be surprised. And here, I think you don't need to do this because we already did it. So here, manifesting generator or generator, the same type of aura and enveloping aura, 70%, projector 20% is focused and absorbing, wait for the invitation. That's what Ra always would say. I think that there are nuances of that. Bitterness success, manifester 9%, reflector 1%. And this is the one for the projector. So you can see here, it's like really honing in on that, that, that focused and penetrating aura is what we have here. And the projector, I honor, I honor my soul's desire by seeking self-nourishment. It's 20% of the population. The aura is focused, penetrating and absorbing. The signature is success, the not self is bitterness. The strategy is waiting to be recognized and invited into projects and activities. So I think recognized or invited can be used interchangeably. Like when you know that you are that you are valued, you actually in a way might not have to wait for the formal invitation. It's already there. Or when you're already in a group and you're already people that already want you there, you are already or you are already invited in, we could say. Let's speak more about that because this is like, you know. I feel like human design is always evolving. So I think we can be in our language, we can become more and more precise. The project, the projector, I'm recognized, invited and available. Then I do. Uh, it's a non-energy type. It has, it has the sacral undefined, no motor centered, defined to the throat. It's about the tuning before getting involved. So feeling, am I welcome? Am I recognized before getting involved? Can feel unappreciated, needs to have inner and outer recognition. You need to feel good about yourself and you need others to feel that, that about you. It's providing guidance and there are different types of projectors. We can go in, I, I think I might have a slide. We can go into different types of projectors as well if you want today. And this is one of the last slides, I believe. So, okay, here's a little bit more about the strategy. So, you, so you're not here to guide everyone. You wait for being recognized, being valued, wait, waiting for the information. You're not here to guide everyone. Not everyone can hear you. Um, guide the people that recognize you wait for a direct request for your presence or your input, your words or your friendship. Uh, recogni recognition is the invitation, wordless or formal. So that's kind of interesting too, wordless. Don't give your energy to every invitation, permission to be picky. Compromise is the death of a projector because if you give your energy to something and it's not really good for you, then you might not have so much energy for anything else. A so compromise it's, is difficult needs and challenges, core needs, to be recognized for who you are, 
to receive attention, to be seen and heard, to be successful, potential challenges, push and hustle. You know, it's not what you are here to do. You're not an energy type. Hooked on results, settling for what is. The world is never going to change. Nobody's ever really going to understand me anyway. So I'm just going to either say my truth or not say my truth. Kind of that like black or white thing. Uh, Overcommitting, imposing your ideas on others, craving attention. And here is the last one, I think. Your genius, deep understanding through questioning and curiosity. You're a natural leader. You're here to recognize people's gifts. You're here to guide people. You're here to bring people together. You're a natural networker and a natural master. And trust. It's about trusting life. It's about, you know, I the worst thing that I that I know is when I feel like projectors are like this, and you're not you're like kind of wait, wait for the invitation, but it's like, you know. You, you don't trust life. So then it's so hard to, to wait for that, for, for being recognized. And it feels like it's never coming. But when life can be trusted, there can be this space and this like space and peace in a way while you're waiting for life to come to you. Life is here to come to you. You don't have to run after it. That will probably be a really um, good thing to remember 